One of the most important aspects of the college experience is the internship process. What better place to learn about the real business world than New York City? Craig Jinjoyan landed his internship at Let's Order Now, an entrepreneurial company where businesses order lunches online. What are you learning on the job that's going to help you in your career path? I'm realizing that it's not about knowing all the numbers and knowing everything in the books. It goes beyond that. You have to be well-rounded and you have to be able to speak to people. That's something that I'm learning every day at Let's Order Now. Going out, pitching things to restaurants, it's growing me as a person. What's been one of the most exciting things that's happened to you on the job? I mean, of course, heading into a new job, everybody has their worries and nerves. And I kind of got that out of the way. When I signed up my first restaurant, it was all momentum from there forward. I was getting restaurant after restaurant after restaurant. How important has the internship process been in terms of your future? Let's Order Now right now is very small. It's a startup company and it has so much growth potential. So as I'm just a freshman, if I can stick with this company for the next three or four years, who knows, it could be the next big thing by the time I graduate. Helping students with the internship process is a focal point at Malloy College. It's an important aspect of why so many high school students making their college decision choose Malloy. Today I'm here with some students from Garden City High School, my old high school, to talk about education and career path opportunities. What do you think is most important to employers in hiring new graduates? As an employer, I think they're looking for somebody who's able to have that background experience, whether it be internships or working in the field, somebody who can conduct themselves in a business meeting, be able to shake their hand and look them in the eye, and definitely shine off well on the company. Have either of you had any personal experience with unemployment, perhaps in your family? Actually, my mom was laid off about a year and a half ago, maybe two years ago. And it's definitely a hard, it's a hard time because you have to basically get into not being able to go to work. And you have to get back out there. You have to get yourself back out there and you have to look for jobs again and you have to find the right fit for you. How do you plan on preparing yourself for the vigorous job market that lies ahead? When I uh, get to college, I want to... Uh, try internships or different clubs that uh, offer opportunities like that. It definitely gives good experience in the field or whatever field you're looking to go into, whether it be business or anything else. And it just helps you when you do get to that professional level that you do have that experience and it, uh, it'll give you that uh, upper hand. What do you think is the biggest challenge you face in entering the business world? Well, there's definitely a lot of people out there who's trying to get into the same uh, jobs. And it's really, it's who you know in a way. You want to basically have those connections and you want to put yourself out there. And so maybe those internships will come and uh, help you out in the future. Do you think this has made a real difference to you? Absolutely. I mean, I for one never like those salespeople that just knock on your door, just walk up to you and say, hey, try this. And now I'm kind of one of those people. So it's really gotten that out of my system and I'm learning how to approach people in that way. Craig, thank you so much for sharing your story. I'm Jennifer Watsak with the Malloy Business Channel in New York City.